Hello everyone, welcome back to Radiology Med Easy, your all-time favorite YouTube channel. Let's see today's case. So, this is the image of today's case. First, go through it and come to your own diagnosis. Then, we will continue with the case discussion. Hello everyone, this is case number 16 of RS series in radiology. Today our case is 40 year old patient presented with intermittent claudication. So this is the frontal chest radiograph of skeletal mature patient. So obviously at a glance uh, you can't see abnormality but when you look at closely you can see some subtle mediastinal widening here yeah. and prominent aortic knuckle also you can see here and so it, it has a figure tree like appearance figure tree appearance is there figure tree appearance so this is the aortic knuckle and this, this one is dilatation of uh, descending thoracic aorta it's a focal dilatation so and also you can see some subtle rib notching yes. some erosions in the inferior aspect of the ribs so rib notching is there inferior rib notching those are the two major features inferior rib notching and uh, otherwise uh, lung paranca may be a normal pulmonary vasculation normal and no cardiomegaly trachea uh, central slightly to deviate to the right side and uh, diaphragm can to a normal so so those are the two major abnormalities figure tree appearance and inferior notching inferior rib notching so in this case the diagnosis is uh, coarctation coarctation of aorta uh, for this kind of a thing uh, differential diagnosis uh, pseudo coarctation pseudo coarctation another one is uh, large large vessel arteritis arteritis those are few uh, differential diagnosis for these kind of lesions large vessel arteritis there can be dilatation of the arteries and sometimes aneurysms of the uh, aorta so the, that can mimic uh, that uh, figure tree appearance so in uh, coarctation the dilatation of aortic knuckle region is due to pre stenotic dilatation of proximal to the obstruction and of uh, actually pre stenotic dilatation of the arch of aorta as well as the left subclavian artery and lower part of the tree is due to post stenotic dilatation so that construct the figure tree appearance inferior notching of the ribs is due to compensatory collateral formation by intercostal arteries so that concludes case number 16 of our RS series Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, then you will get notifications of our new videos. And also, you can comment on our videos. Thank you, everyone. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more videos like this.